Have you ever been curious about how sound travels from its source to your brain? Let's take the example of a piano to understand this process. When a piano is played, it creates sound waves in the air. These waves are caught by the outer ear and then travel through the ear canal, a narrow passageway. The sound waves reach the eardrum, which is a small membrane roughly the size of a dime, and cause it to vibrate. This vibration is then transferred to three tiny bones known as the malleus, incus, and stapes, which amplify the sound vibrations and send them to the cochlea. The cochlea is a spiral-shaped organ filled with fluid, similar in size to a garden pea. As the sound vibrations reach the cochlea, the fluid inside begins to ripple, creating waves. Hair-like structures called stereocilia sit on top of hair cells inside the cochlea, forming hair cell bundles. The hair bundles are then moved by the waves and the movements are converted into electrical signals by the hair cells. The electrical signals generated by the hair cells are transmitted to the auditory nerve cells, which are then turned into chemical signals. These chemical signals bind to the auditory nerve cells, creating an electrical signal that travels along the auditory nerve to the brain. Different hair cells respond to different frequencies of sound. Finally, the electrical signal is carried by the auditory nerve to the brain, where it is interpreted as the sounds that we recognize and understand.